Okay, uh, if you're watching the clock, you're aware we are at the end of our program. Uh, so uh, you will be able to see Mohan and the others in, um, in the playground afterwards. We'll be moving into the reception. Uh, I will keep my closing thoughts very brief. Now, if you want to know my real thoughts, come find me over a drink. <laughs> okay, so just a quick flyover. I warned you it'd be uh, a pretty dense day today. Uh, we're only through the first half day, uh, and you've already seen incredible journey uh, that this technology and this community has really embarked on and how far we've come in so many different dimensions. We began with the clinical perspective, which, as I said, has become the hallmark of this uh, community. Uh, we got those clinical perspectives. Uh, we heard how they're uh, really using the technology. Again, groundbreaking. And hopefully, for those of you who are in the upstream part, you're thinking about how does my work affect what they do on a day-to-day -day basis, because in the end, it really is all about the patients. Uh, it reminded me, listening um, and seeing what they were talking about, to this uh, actual quote from our last uh, meeting, uh, the symposium, uh, which was talking about uh, the future and how all this information that you heard the clinicians and the researchers talk about today is changing the way we think about how we deliver medicine. Um, and this was from Partho Sengupta, who's head of cardiology at Robert Wood Johnson Center, um, been with the project for a while. And he's thinking about really the cardiology department of the future. How will we be building cardiology departments 20 years from now based on changing the way we actually see it. Um, I'll, I'll flip over that. Um, we saw how the clinicians are, the clinician experience is being captured, the patient experience. So instead of thinking only about how the device works on a machine, the, pharma, the medical device companies are now looking at how their device, in this case pacemakers, work on a patient. So having that patient in the lab, in this case, the virtual twin of the patient, is changing the way they're thinking about developing products. And then, of course, looking to the future, uh, we heard about uh, what we're doing uh, to enable uh, the innovators. So tomorrow, we have twice as much content, <laughs> if you can imagine. So be prepared. We have a very big journey. We'll hear, <clears throat> I won't go through it in the interest of time. Uh, we have quite a lot. We'll start again. Uh, from the big picture, and we'll work our way down. We'll hear about different organs, some new introductory, some new projects that are being launched. I think you'd be pretty excited to hear that. Uh, not only are there new projects, but there's actually a new room that we'll be in. So today we're in this room. The playground's right across the way. Tomorrow, don't forget this, it's actually a different room. So it's up on the sixth floor. Um, leave yourself an extra couple of minutes to find it, um, and uh, it'll be set up very similar. It'll look just like this, just six floors up. So don't come here, come there. The playground will still be in the same place, so we'll have to pop up and down. I left a little more time for breaks tomorrow uh, so you can manage the elevators. So now, uh, with that, I'd like to close for the day. Uh, fortunately, uh, we're not sending you off empty-handed. We're gonna send you off uh, with the reception. You'll get to share your thoughts network over the next couple of hours, uh, play with the experiences. Uh, I do have a couple of housekeeping things to note, I think, on the next slide. Yes. OK. <clears throat> so, uh, so first, before you disappear, we want to get your picture. If you spent the day today here, we want to document that so you can't pretend you weren't here. No excuses. So before you leave, I think uh, somebody will confirm that there'll be a photographer. Um, and then move over to the reception. We'll be open until about 7 p.m., um, so enjoy that. And then tomorrow morning, uh, breakfast at 7 uh, on the sixth floor. Uh, nope. Breakfast is here. Great. Breakfast is here. The meeting is upstairs. So with that, I want to thank all the speakers today, everyone here in Boston, everyone out um, listening to us live. Uh, I think you know, we've come on a long journey. It's been a long afternoon. Uh, let's all uh, congratulate ourselves on an excellent, excellent day.